Real Women Murders, Not Fiction. Tiffany K. Ma Horder, age 42, gunned down March 12, 2024, with two other women in North Las Vegas, Nevada. God bless her family and friends. Damn. I'm Kirsten Joyce. And I'm Brian Loftus. Police have yet to say what may have led up to the murders. It happened near Civic Center in Cary yesterday afternoon. 8 News Now reporter Joshua Piguero joining us live with what people are saying at this apartment complex. Brian, Kirsten, I've spoken with people in this neighborhood and they recall hearing the gunshots and taking cover yesterday. Now, this is the building where the shooting occurred. Police say it happened at two apartments, but what's unclear is a motive. There were some gunshots and ultimately those women were killed along with the dog. Luis Escobosa was right next door when the shootings happened. We were standing right there when we heard the first gunshot. We thought there was some construction, but no, it was when he killed them and the dog. A man who manages the property where the murders occurred tells me it's a second chance building. He says some of his tenants are recommended from domestic violence organizations. I saw Kenneth Hayes leave one of the apartments the women were shot in. How did they know each other? Associates. They knew each other, friends, or hang out. Something like that. So, but what would, if they're friends, what would drive okay. the dude? Drive the I don't know. He's asking the wrong person. I pressed Hayes on why they were inside his place. I don't know. I wasn't there. I can't answer that question. I don't know. Victor Fuentes says he was inside his friend's second floor apartment Tuesday when he heard gunshots. So even when I did hear it, I didn't, I didn't think nothing of it. It wasn't until we got evacuated where I was like, man. Then, uh, uh, yeah, we weren't able to come home until like this morning at like 8, 9 o'clock. Now, the Clark, County, the Clark County Coroner's Office ID the shooter as 43-year-old Edward Brooks. That's the courtyard where police shot him after he refused to drop his weapon. Reporting live in North Las Vegas, Joshua Pagaro, 8 News Now. Thank you, Joshua. Safe Nest providing us with a statement on the deaths of those three women saying, in part, we continue to see epidemic rates of domestic and sexual violence while doing our best with limited resources to house and keep survivors safe. While confidential... Stop the gun violence. Why? It's wrong. Homicide we've been telling you about in North Las Vegas this week. The county coroner identifying her as 42-year-old Tiffany Mahorder. 52-year-old Africa Woods and 48-year-old Venus Hart were also killed. They were ID'd earlier this week. Police say officers arriving on scene saw a man with a gun coming toward them when he wouldn't stop or, or drop the gun. Officers opened fire and killed him. That gunman later identified as 43-year-old Edward Brooks. Police say they will provide uh, body camera footage and 911 audio on Monday, so we'll bring that to you. We're also expecting to find out the names of the officers who shot Brooks. A crucial reminder here, help is available. If you or anyone you know is a victim of domestic violence, you can call the phone number there on your screen or simply text the word START to 88788. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.